So in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can get a web page source with the help of PB.net. So what we are going to do is a program similar to web scraper in which a website is loaded first and source for the website is scraped from the backend. So let's first create a project. Select Windows Forms application. Choose any name you want. Click on OK. This will create a blank form. Resize it as per your convenience. Then drop rich text box to the right and take it to the size that you find fit. Okay. Now on the left side, use web browser. Okay. Align it properly. Now drag and drop the button here. Change the name to something like let's say get source. Okay. Now for that we are also going to assign an action. Before that, let's save our form and preview it. Okay. So here is our browser and here is the text box. Okay, now the first thing we have to do is we have to add button action here, which should be web browser one, calling that control, then navigate. Let's say I want to go to Bing website. Okay. Now let's back to the form. And for rich text, let's have action where we are scraping web browser's text. So let's have it here. Rich text box one. Dot text equals to web browser one dot document text. Save this. Go back to the form and now let's save it and execute it. Okay, now I'm going to click get source which should bring home page here and from that source should be extracted. So think of it as a scraper and it is going to get the source of website. For clicking on it, it will take a few moments to load Bing website. Once loaded completely it should show you the text here. There are some element left to load, then it will not show you this scraping text yet. Okay, so let's check out if our code was right. Now, as you have noticed, the thing is that the code goes wrong because we have this subroutine on which text box text change method. But it should be instead on this form. It's web browser one document completed. 
okay and pasting it here so in order to make that change make sure our browser is selected and then just copy from here and to this subroutine now save it and execute it okay so you notice that I'm going to load this web page and simultaneously source will be showing it okay so this is how our scraper works so we can similarly see scraping of few other sites as well so i hope you found this tutorial helpful if you have any questions suggestions regarding video then do let me know in the comments thank you